What's up guys, welcome to Products Room. Choosing the best slow cooker can be confusing, especially with so many options available in the market. Luckily, to help you find the right one for your needs, we've done the homework for you, and we have compiled a list of some of the best slow cookers you can buy right now, so be sure to stay till the end, so you don't miss anything. Before we start our list, I have a question for you. Have you ever used a slow cooker before, or are you using it right now? If so, let us know in the comments which slow cooker you have, and what is your opinion on it. Now, let's get started. The first slow cooker on our list is Hamilton Beach 6 Quart Programmable Slow Cooker. Our top pick for the best slow cooker goes to the Hamilton Beach Set and Forget for its excellent cooking results, reasonable price, and exceptional added features. Those added features include two real standouts, a temperature probe that allows users to monitor the temperature of large cuts of meat, and a variety of useful cooking modes that include defrost, hold temperature, and simmer. The hold temperature mode ensures that when food reaches the proper temperature, it will stay there for a whopping 24 hours. We cooked a 7-pound pork roast comfortably in the set and forget, and were especially impressed with the temperature probe option because it allowed us to raise the setting to high and speed up cooking time without worrying that the meat would become tough. We also loved its overall design. The casing didn't get too hot during cooking, it was small enough to store easily, and it felt sturdy without being too heavy. There was no visible dripping between the lining and the casing while it ran either. The average price of all the large slow cookers we tested was $175, so the fact that this is on the lower side of the price spectrum is quite impressive, given the quality and added features. There are lid clips that allow you to transport the slow cooker with food inside, which is useful when taking it to a party or potluck. And the hold temperature function allows you to cook an impressive array of foods, including those that need to braise and simmer, in addition to more experimental dishes like yogurt and fondue. The slow cooker goes up to 200 degrees Fahrenheit, and it has a clear display screen that shows both the current temperature and the programmed temperature. Plus, both the lining and the casing are dishwasher safe. The one downside we noticed is that the lack of backlight on the display screen means that you need to get pretty close to see how your meal is progressing. The next slow cooker on our list is Green Life Cook Duo Slow Cooker. The biggest highlight of this slow cooker is its inner lining. Green Life is focused on eco-friendly materials, and the lining is made of a thin ceramic non-stick material, which the brand claims creates 60% fewer carbon emissions than other non-ceramic linings during the curing phase. But there are other benefits of the ceramic liner. It can be used directly on the stove or in the oven to create a deeper, browner crust on large cuts of meat or, say, a shepherd's pie. While we didn't need to attend to a meatless doll we made in the pot, meat dishes required a little more attention. When cooking a pot roast, we needed to stir it a few times and add an extra hour of cooking to achieve the classic fall-off-the-bone texture associated with the dish. We gave it high marks for its easy-to-use interface, which is basic enough for anyone to use. Nothing seemed to stick to the lining after cooking either. The two largest inconveniences we discovered have to do with the lid and the hard-to-store base. The lid isn't locking, and it sits on top of the slow cooker in a way that we didn't feel was very secure. That can be fine if you're not touching it, but will make transporting it a near impossibility. Additionally, the plug does not remove itself from the base like with other models, so it's a little awkward to store it in a cabinet. Still, for the price, it works quite well, and even comes in a few different colors to match anyone's kitchen decor. The next slow cooker on our list is Green Pan Elite 8-in-1 Slow Cooker. Let's start with the obvious, something this splurge-worthy must be beautiful, and the Green Pan Elite Slow Cooker is gorgeous. We love its sleek and minimal design, which comes in a variety of beautiful colors that might make you rethink storing it out of sight. Its well-placed handles are covered in silicone and allow you to lift the pot with ease without worrying about it being too hot to carry. We also found that its rounded rectangular shape allows you to fit a variety of items, like a full rack of baby back ribs or a substantial pork roast with veggies, without running out of space, despite its relatively compact size. We thought its stylish digital control panel was intuitive and easy to use, and when using any of its many settings, we observed that the Green Pan Elite cooked food to perfection with no signs of hot spots or scorching. We also found that the pot's ceramic non-stick interior contributed to its even cooking, working with the cooker's thick casing to create a withstanding Dutch oven-like product. So, this slow cooker could be worth the splurge because, although you might be able to find some that perform similarly for cheaper, it's unlikely that they'll be as aesthetically pleasing as this one. The next slow cooker on our list is Cuisinart 3-in-1 Cook Central 6-Quart Multi-Cooker. While the Cuisinart Cook Central 3-in-1 primarily works as a slow cooker, its other functions, including a sauté and a steam mode, elevate it to a more sophisticated level. The sauté, brown feature allows the slow cooker to heat up to 400 degrees Fahrenheit, and is meant for users to brown cuts of meat or vegetables for stews or roasts directly in the non-stick aluminum lining without having to dirty another dish. To steam vegetables or fish, add the included steamer insert, 
plus some water or broth, and go. And, of course, it works quite well as a regular slow cooker, with options to set a temperature, along with three additional modes, high, low, and simmer. The features are slightly elevated versions of what you'd expect from a classic slow cooker. The backlit LCD display shows cooking time and temperature, while the control panel also includes a 24-hour programmable timer, a keep warm option, and a start and stop button. We were impressed with its roomy oblong shape, and also appreciated the feature that allows the user to add or subtract minutes from the cooking time while the device is in use. While the lid doesn't have a locking feature, it still received high marks for securely fitting on top during the cooking process. We noted that food cooked more evenly in this slow cooker than in models previously used, with the tri-tip becoming fork tender in just 7 hours. It also warmed stewed chicken meat for tacos and the tri-tip for at least 30 minutes while prepping other dinner items without the dishes becoming rubbery or overcooked. Users should note that it's a fairly bulky, heavy option at 16 pounds and 18 inches in width. Due to the luxe price tag, we don't think this is the best option if you want a slow cooker that just handles the basics. The next slow cooker on our list is Crock-Pot Mini 1.5 Quart Round Manual Slow Cooker. This slow cooker from Crock-Pot is about as basic as you're going to get. There are no modes, no settings, and no temperature adjustments. To get it to work, just plug it in. But this 1.5 quart model has its benefits if you're cooking a hot dip for a party or you're a single person or couple who can't stand the thought of leftovers. We made spinach dip and a buttery wine broth to spoon over clams. Both yielded delicious results, although following a recipe proved challenging, considering the smaller size meant we needed to calculate different proportions. Still, they were satisfied with the ease of use and the taste of the dishes. We also prepared a baked potato and a sweet potato, which lacked the crispy skin an oven delivers, but resulted in a creamy, perfectly cooked spud. Potential consumers should note that the outer casing gets incredibly hot while cooking, so it may not be advised to use it as a serving dish at parties or around kids. We also noted the outer casing feels flimsier than other models, so you may have to replace it every few years. Still, we felt it was a convenient tool that kept food warm without overheating or scorching, staying at a perfect temperature throughout the process. The next slow cooker on our list is Crock-Pot 8-Quart Programmable Slow Cooker. This is the best slow cooker for big batch cooking. With 8 quarts of capacity, it could easily make food to feed over 10 people. It's a fairly basic option with a glass lid, an internal stoneware pot, and a stainless steel exterior. It has dishwasher safe parts and a simple interface with 3 heat settings and a timer that can be set for up to 20 hours. We were most impressed with its ability to maintain a steady, accurate temperature without any hot spots and a completely even cook. We cooked chili on low for 9 hours and pork tacos on high for 5. Both came out well without having to stir or tend to them during cooking, which is certainly a bonus. The biggest issue is the lid. When the food was simmering at just under 200 degrees Fahrenheit, we noticed ample steam escaping, and the lid was visibly rattling. While it didn't affect the internal temperature, it's probably not a slow cooker you'd want to leave going while you're not there. There are some other notable issues that don't affect the quality of the cook but may sway consumers one way or another. The first is that the steel exterior feels thin, which could lead to dents and dings in the future, although we didn't report any damage during use. And the second is that it's a bit hard to clean. The stoneware insert is large and heavy, and while it's dishwasher safe, it's likely hard to fit in anything smaller than a farmhouse sink. The next slow cooker on our list is Cuisinart Cook Central 4-Quart Multi-Cooker. This Cuisinart Multi-Cooker is a smaller version of the best programmable slow cooker, and it has many of the same specs while being smaller. It can make a lot of food for two people, so consider it the perfect size for singles or couples who like to prepare big batch meals with lots of leftovers, or even for a family of three or four. It's also a decently high-tech option for a smaller kitchen. The slow cooker can saute or brown food for deeper flavor before slow cooking roasts, or chilies, and it also has an included steam rack for the option to steam vegetables or fish as well. The backlit LCD display screen showcases both time and temperature, and it's capable of going up to 400 degrees Fahrenheit. We cooked a variety of meals in this slow cooker, from taco filling to chili to spinach dip. Most foods were completely set it and forget it, with some needing a simple stir on occasion. We were especially impressed with the chicken breast, which is a notoriously hard food to get moist and tender without overcooking. At first, it seemed to be boiling, but the results were perfectly juicy once complete. We gave the silicone gasket around the lid high marks. It added extra security and prevented any steam from escaping during cook time. The outer casing doesn't get hot either, so it would indeed be great to leave out at a party, even if there are little kids running around. One small note, there's no way to manually turn on the keep warm option. Instead, once the timer you set runs out and you're done cooking, it automatically switches to this setting. The next slow cooker on our list is Kalfalin Digital Sade Slow Cooker. This Kalfalin is the best slow cooker for someone who wouldn't dare make a roast without sufficiently caramelizing the outside. 
while some slow cookers have a saute option. It won't get nearly as hot as an oven, which is why this is a great pick. You can put the insert directly on the stove for high heat that creates a more extreme sear or crust. It's safe to use on a gas, electric, or induction range, and is also oven safe. However, it's a smaller insert, which we think would make it hard to navigate a larger roast for an even brown. While the slow cooker is smaller than the standard 6-quart options, at 5.3 quarts, it should still make around 6 servings. It's a suitable option for a small family that likes leftovers or a medium-sized household. However, the small size also makes it easier to store, which is a major plus for apartments. It's also fairly lightweight at under 10 pounds. The adjustable knob makes going from the high setting to the warm setting incredibly easy, and we appreciate that it allows adjustments in 15-minute intervals rather than the standard 30 or an hour found on other models. The cooker also has a rubber seal around the lid, which means it's sturdy and won't rattle or allow for steam to escape. We appreciated the lightweight liner and the secure handles, all of which added to its ability to use, clean, and store easily. The next slow cooker on our list is Crock-Pot Small Casserole Slow Cooker. This manual slow cooker is the only option on the list that has a shallow, wide liner, which means it's perfect for making casserole-style dishes and large amounts of dip for parties or tailgates. It's the best slow cooker on this list for travel too, thanks to a very secure locking lid. We felt it was both sturdy and light, although, at 13.5 pounds, it's not the lightest on this list by any means, with a shape that would likely fit securely on a car seat. There are handles on the side that make it easy to carry, although the only issue one might consider for large get-togethers is that the outer casing gets fairly hot during cooking. This is notable because there's no light indicator that lets you know it's on, which can lead to some burnt fingertips down the road if you're not careful. Because it's manual, it can only be programmed by a dial that allows the user to choose high, low, and warm. Even so, we were happy with the results of the various foods we made, with some stirring required on occasion but no clotting or separating. The biggest hurdle to using this crock pot is its size. We found that it was too small to fit recipes made for 6-quart slow cookers, but too large for recipes catered to small ones. This is another reason why casseroles and similar dishes work the best, as the shallow shape is similar to that of a glass oven dish. There was some issue with the dip getting slightly burned on the sides, which is likely because it was spread out too thin. But the queso we prepared didn't have this problem, so there may be a learning curve when it comes to figuring out proportions. Still, a 20-minute soak and a trip to the dishwasher easily cleaned residue off the liner. The next slow cooker on our list is Ninja Foodi Possible Cooker Pro. The largest of all the models we tested, the Ninja Foodi Possible Cooker Pro offers a bevy of bells and whistles. You can directly sear and saute right in the pot, it's oven safe up to 500 degrees Fahrenheit, and the insert doubles as an elegant serving dish. Thanksgiving just got easier. The most impressive feature of this model is the triple fusion heat technology. The bottom heat allows you to saute ingredients right in the pot. The side heat ensures even heat distribution, and the steam heat keeps everything moist while cooking. It is the only model on our list with these capabilities, and it lived up to the 30% faster cook time advertised. For testing, we prepared beef brisket and two rounds of oatmeal. The 8.5-quart insert offered plenty of room for everything we loaded, and the included utensil and utensil rest on top came in handy. It did take up a fair amount of counter real estate, but with 14 cooking functions, it does the work of all those other appliances. It does have handles on both the insert and the base, but at a shade over 12 pounds, we found it bulky to transport and we wish we had a little more control over programming the cook times. Like the Kaufland model from our list, this one is dishwasher safe but didn't require a cycle in our tests. The non-stick coating was so functional that a swipe with a clean paper towel was all that was needed, and there was no observable spillage or buildup between the interior and exterior. This Lux slow cooker is perfect for an enthusiastic home cook who wants to explore all of its functionality. Alright guys, that's all for now, thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video, and this video helped you out. Don't forget to leave a like, and subscribe to the channel to see more videos like this in the future. I hope to see you guys in the next video. Till next time, see you later.